What's up mga kasabwat? This is Ben, your kasabwat, once again for another car review episode. Alam niyo mga kasabwat, uh, throughout the years, hanggang sa ngayon, nandyan pa rin yung mahigpit na rivalry ng mga car dealership sa bansa natin when it comes selling cars. But things quite changed now when these new car brands entered in the Philippine automotive market industry. Where in these cars is more sophisticated, it has advanced technology, modern, luxurious designs, sales at cheaper price na hindi natin nakikita kalimitan sa mga nakagisnan nating car brands. In fact, uh, one of car brand pull out one of their model units um, and build a new one, sell it at cheaper price. I think it's because to keep up with the pricing competition. Now, Ford Philippines I think already know that this is coming so they also acted quickly that is why this uh, new crossover is born meet the 2021 Ford Territory <laughs> Before we move forward nga pala mga kasabwat, gusto kong ipakilala sa inyo ang ating kasabwat sa Ford Global City. Hi guys! So we're inviting you here to visit our showroom here at Ford Global City. I'm your sales consultant, Flesh Jundis. My contact number is 0917 You can also visit all Auto Hub dealership nationwide. This is the top of the line. Ford Territory Titanium Plus. Now, starting sa front end, ano ba makikita natin? As you can see, it has a stylish design equipped with LED headlamps, LED daytime running light, and turn indicator on the top of the halogen fog lamps. You have the gloss black grille with front camera on the top of the Ford badge and chrome inserts which gives premium look. It also has these character lines that gives aggressive look ng front fascia. And down the front bumper, you have this front parking sensors and faux silver skid plate, which gives sporty look and contrast with the color. Now, moving on the side section of the body, ano ba yung una nating mapapansin? You would actually notice the striking character lines from the front door all the way to the taillight. The fender is kind of bold, which actually gives this vehicle a masculine touch. You have the chrome door handle with smart keyless entry button. Uh, this vehicle is also equipped with heated power adjust folding side mirror integrated with turn indicator light and camera for its 360 view. They also added a chrome straight line on the side skirt to further enhance the look. I also like the C-pillar, the small window on the back side. They made it bigger so it gives more visibility. And you also get an 18-inch uh, two-tone alloy wheels. The front and rear are both disc brake wrapped with Goodyear tires with a size of 235 by 55. And you have a ground clearance of 180 millimeters. Now, moving on the back end, starting from the top, you have the panoramic moonroof, roof rails, shark fin antenna, roof spoiler with mounted backlight, you also have the LED tail light with chrome accent. You have the name territory spelled out on the tailgate. Uh, they should make it bigger para mas aggressive. You have also the rear view camera. And down the rear bumper, you also have the rear parking sensors, rear center fog light, and two reflector on both sides. And you have the static quad exhaust pipes. Now, check naman natin ang cargo space sa likod. As you can see, it has a nice cargo space. You got 420 liters of trunk space. 
This unit is also equipped with 60-40 split folding second row seat. So kung gusto mo ng mas maluwag na space sa likod, it can be folded almost flat and you would get a total of 1,120 liters cargo space. Now inside the trunk, you have the luggage cover, trunk light, and another 12 volt socket. And under the trunk floor cover, you have the tools and the same size na reserve tire comes with steel wheel. Okay mga sabot, andito tayo ngayon sa 2021 Ford. Unang pasok ko pa lang, ah, nakita ko na yung magandang design and very comfortable siya. It's like 90% are combination of soft touch material sa loob. Like on this side, napakaganda ng pagka-design nila. You have this uh, soft touch plastic, you have faux wood accent here and nilagyan nila ng piano black accent. And over here, it's a uh, leather we have white stitches and dito sa may door handle nilagyan nila ng uh, silver accent which give contrast uh, napakagandang tignan and down here you have a uh, cubby holes para uh, para sa maliit na storage and you have the uh, power window control equipped with one touch up and down uh, on all windows you also have this uh, uh, control ng ating power adjust and power uh, folding side mirror meron na rin siyang heated features okay moving on sa steering wheel natin so this is a leather wrap steering wheel medyo makapal siya so maganda sa sa grip sa kamay and you have mounted controls for instrument cluster and for multimedia you also have this um, silver uh, accent that gives contrast sa uh, blackish color ng ng uh, steering wheel and of course this uh, steering wheel can be adjusted through tilt and telescopic you also have this standard lever for our wiper for our headlamps and down here you have the control for the adaptive uh, course control and also this is equipped with forward collision warning so basically kapag ka, uh, nag forward ka pa rin na nakalimutan mo mag preno magwa warning siya I think very standard yan sa mga uh, top of the line na uh, Ford vehicles. Okay, so moving on the dashboard, ano ba makikita natin dito? So this dashboard is made of soft touch plastic which I like personally. And you have this uh, air convent uh, with piano black and wood, faux wood accent. And yung... Uh, push start button ng engine natin is on the left side instead of the uh, right side I think that's because of the design and you have this uh, 10 inch fully digital instrument cluster display with three selectable themes so kung medyo kung all this ka you can choose classic kung medyo gusto mo yung cool tignan you can choose fashion and kung gusto mo yung futuristic you can choose a sport now uh, this vehicle also equipped with a 10 inch uh, touchscreen infotainment system uh, with piano black uh, finish which hindi ko gusto personally kasi madaling magasgas to so prone sa mga scratches the infotainment system of 2021 territory is equipped with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto this top of the line has a 6 airbags just below this 10 inch infotainment you have this uh, piano buttons for our air conditioning system you have the two usb ports for charging and for data and then when you open this cover uh, you have the uh, wireless uh, charging for our smartphone and you also have this 12 volts uh, socket now moving sa center console natin which is quite massive 
uh, you have this piano black finish again and with uh, silver accent which again give contrast na naman sa looks niya para medyo magandang tignan medyo luxurious ang tignan and you have this controls for lane departure warning uh, park assist or parking assist uh, this is where the vehicle can park on its own either uh, para parallel or perpendicular you have this switch also for on and off ng uh, parking sensor and you you have this electronic parking brake you also have this auto hold and the button for uh, for sports mode and you have this dial switch for I think this is for the uh, infotainment system natin and you also have the button for home back and then music uh, meron kong nag-iisang uh, cup holders dito and you have this uh, armrest with dual lid uh, cover so, and and then napakaluwag ng storage sa loob okay pagdating naman dito sa seats napaka comfortable it has a perforated seats yung may mga maliliit na butas so uh, comfortable siya uh, nakikita lang natin to minsan sa mga luxury na sasakyan and this is a power adjust seat so uh, it has a 10 way power adjust seat so you can move forward backward uh, recline pwede mo siyang itaas ibaba and then it also has a uh, lumbar support adjustment uh, but this is only for the driver side for the passenger side it also it only has a uh, four way uh, manual adjustment so moving on the top naman tayo you have this uh, vanity mirror with light for both uh, driver and passenger uh, you have this uh, auto dimming rear view mirror uh, equipped with single uh, USB port dito so maganda to sa mga gustong maglagay ng uh, dash camera so hindi mo na kailangan igapang yung, uh, yung mga wire so you can just put it here and then of course you have this uh, sand glass holder uh, buttons for our map light and the control for our uh, panoramic moonroof so dito naman tayo sa second row seats ano ba makikita natin dito so uh, same as the uh, driver side door same design naman sila and then uh, you have this uh, tw Twitter speaker uh, this is part of the 8 way speaker ng top of the line so you have one each speaker sa driver passenger you have two sa, sa taas ng dashboard and then so you have uh, one each sa magkabilang pintuan dito sa second row seat and of course you have this two uh, tweeter you have this pocket you have uh, two air convent which is magugustuhan to ng mga car buyers and just down below you have the uh, single uh, uh, charging USB port now uh, this seats is also perforated seats and you have this uh, center uh, armrest with uh, two cup holders and moving on the top you have this uh, cabin light so you can switch it by pressing this on and off and you have this uh, handle say to us and if you can see uh, ang legroom natin is napakalaki as well as the headroom sa mga kasing tangkad ko very comfortable pa rin dito sa second row seat napakaluwag now moving under the hood you got 1.5 liter ecoboost gasoline engine it produces 141 horsepower at 45 to 5200 rpm it has a maximum pulling power of 225 newton meters of torque at 1500 to 4000 rpm mated with continuously variable transmission with sport mode this vehicle exterior is also equipped with ambient lighting the side mirror has a puddle lumps it also equipped with automatic rain sensing wiper speed sensing door lock and automatic on and off headlamps this vehicle is also equipped with autonomous emergency braking adaptive cruise control with forward collision warning lane departure warning system 
Enhance Active Bark Assist, Blind Spot Information System, Hill Launch Assist, Electronic Stability Control includes ABS, EBD, and Traction Control, 6 airbags, Parking Sensors, High Definition 360 Camera, TPMS which is the Tire Pressure Monitoring System, and ISOFIX. Okay, so mga kasabot, andito tayo ngayon sa loob ng 2021 uh, Ford Territory. Uh, andito tayo sa rough road, medyo malubak. So, suspension-wise, malambot siya. Napakaganda ng suspension niya. So, siya nga pala, ang suspension nito is independent McPherson sa harap. And sa likod naman, it uses uh, multi-link suspension. So, kaya maganda yung suspension niya. And ang steering wheel niya, sobrang lambot ang sarap. Like dun sa nabanggit ko kanina, uh, this uh, leather wrap, makapal siya, hindi siya yung manipis, so maganda sa grip ng kamay. This uh, vehicle is equipped with auto hold, so ayan, ipipress ko yung auto hold and I, I can release the brake, so hindi na siya on that, even if naka drive mode siya. Nowadays, napaka uh, very uh, standard na sa mga sasakyan ng auto hold. Uh, para less hassle during traffic iba hindi ka na yung naka uh, press sa pedal every time na traffic so you can always uh, alisin na yung paa mo sa, sa brake and it will automatically uh, hold yung sasakyan okay and then when you press the gas pedal uh, mag disengage si auto hold so matik na yun uh, move forward ka na So yung unang apak mo sa gas pedal, responsive ka agad siya. Wala akong na-feel na lagginess or uh, hesitation. Very responsive siya. And yung torque ng sasakyan when you uh, press uh, ang gas pedal, ramdam mo ka agad. Uh, let's do yung naka-deactivate si auto hold. Tignan natin kung paano ang response ni MG. As of now, naka naka-apak ako sa brake pad ayun so responsive din siya. and then as we drive pala uh, siguro try natin mag drive ng mga 30 minutes uh, tignan natin yung estimated fuel consumption as of now hindi ko pa magawang mag drive ng at least 100 kilometers to get the accurate uh, fuel consumption uh, kasi puno yung schedule Ayan, nadaan kami sa mga humps and very comfortable yung suspension. So, as of now, naka-eco uh, mode tayo. So, we will try the sports mode later. Kahit eco mode, napaka-responsible. And, ang brake system niya maganda din. Uh, mababaw. Kagat kaagad yung brake. And, one thing na nagustuhan ko dito kay uh, territory is it has a uh, power adjust so yung pinaka nagustuhan ko dito yung lumbar support so meron sang adjustment so ayan lalo na sa mga tumatanda ayan napakaganda ng features na yan and of course it has it has an heated and cooled seats so kung may initan ka pwede mong palamigin at kung malamig sila labas or say nasa bagyo kayo you can always uh, set it to heat para medyo uminit yung kwitan mo and isang napansin ko mga kasagot sa, sa loob dito sa, mang, sa bandang side ng steering wheel may similarity sila ng Subaru yung Forester and yung insulation sa loob maganda hindi mo masyadong naririnig yung sa labas and very responsive yung manubela ayan Isa pang napansin ko, uh, maganda yung side mirror, malaki. So, kitang kita mo talaga yung nasa side ko. It's bigger than yung inong mga standard na ano, na side mirror. Ang gaang ng steering wheel mga kasawat. So, barang ganda. And yung pagka leather wrap niya talagang solid. 
So dahil CVT ito, continuously variable transmission, hindi mo ramdam yung pag-shift ng gear. Hindi mo siya maramdaman. And isa pang magandang features nito mga kasabot, uh, meron siyang yung standard na features sa mga top of the line ng Ford is yung autonomous uh, braking system. Um, and uh, forward collision warning. Um, so yung autonomous braking system ito yung pag nakalimutan mo talaga mag brake automatic na magbi brake si vehicle para sa'yo and then yung forward collision uh, warning naman magwa warning yun pagka malapit ka na sa, sa sasakyan sa unahan mo so marami siyang uh, good features ok let's try ang sports mode ano natin ang paanong response wow <laughs> Lumilipad <laughs> Panalo to <laughs> Wow This is good Real good Ganda ng sports mode mga kasabat uh, This uh, uh, vehicle is really promising Sa tingin ko Malaki ang malaki ang mag magbebenta nito for this year. Okay, we currently on the sports mode pa rin. Kita try naman natin yung ano yung uh U-turn tingnan natin yung turning radio. Tingnan natin yung uh body roll kung may mararamdaman tayo. Ngayon tahimik niya sa loob. And yung sports mode na team, napaka-stick din, no? very futuristic. It also has a outside temperature. So, grabe ang hatak talaga niya pag sports mode, mga kasagwa. The best. <laughs> Ganda ng ano niya Ng Liko niya It's fun to drive mga kasabwat Sobra And one thing na na-notice ko mga kasabwat Kapag ang vehicle is uh, May mga katabi Mag-automatic yung 360 uh, View camera So ayan, makikita mo 360 yung sa gilid mo, sa taas mo Which is cool, di ba? Ayan, no? Hin Ang bilis niya, tapos uh, Hindi ganun kalakas yung ano, yung Yung sounds ng engine So maganda yung insulation niya Yung biglang liko, wala siyang ganong body roll tapat na lapat ng apat na gulong uh, yun di ba di ba ma'am wala napaka smooth yung biglang liko pataas oh no problem pataas sisiw so ayan mga kasabot pag medyo na gipit kami dito so nade-detect sya ng uh, parking sensor So kung naanoy kayo, you can always turn it off. Ayan, so, wala na siya. Try natin yung U-turn. Ano yung turning radius niya? So, ang ganda ng laki ng turning radius niya, oh. Ay, makakasabwat. The best ano pang hinihintay nyo, visit uh, Ford Global City and look for Mount Les Mount Les, kasama ko ngayon so we're heading back and we will try the uh, park assist kahit naka drive mode, napakaganda ng hata 
So hindi mo na kailangan mag sports mode. Sobra ako na amazed mga kasabot. Ang tahimik. Suspension wise. Sobrang smooth. Wala wala akong masabi. For the price point of 1.3. Almost sabi mo ng 1.3. Sabi ka pa. You have it all dito sa 2021 Ford Territory. If you wanted to experience yung ganda ng suspension driving experience ni uh, Ford Territory, okay, visit nyo lang ang Ford Global City. They can always assist you. Uh, the demo units is always available. Hanapin nyo lang si Ma'am Clash. Okay, we're heading back sa Ford Global City and we will try the perpendicular and parallel to parking ni Ford Territory. So, tignan natin kung gaano ka astig yun mga kasabwat. So, ayan mga kasabwat, try natin tong parallel uh, auto park assist. And reverse natin. So, ikaw ang magkocontrol ng ano, ikaw magkocontrol ng gas pedal, si... <laughs> Tignan nyo Medyo nakakaba <laughs> Okay, sasabihin niya Reverse na naman Ayan, oh. Reverse So reverse Ayan. Sasabihin niya, switch to D. Drive forward. Ayan, parking complete. Ayan, di lang mabasa. Now, let's check the uh, fuel consumption. So, this is just for city driving uh, combination of sports mode and uh, drive mode. Now, the total uh, kilometers uh, for almost 30 minutes driving is 9.9 .9 kilometers now to get the kilometers per liter you divide 100 from 9.9 .9 kilometers so that's 10.10 .10, uh, kilometers uh, per liter so that's not bad sa tingin ko mga kasabot, because of its price point 1,299,000 and because of its uh, advanced security features uh, good handling good suspension uh, good ride and luxurious design I think uh, Ford Territory will be the next uh, best-selling crossover in the Philippine market with its uh, dimension uh, it's comparable with uh, Gili Ascara and um, Forrester kung titignan nyo naman yung uh, difference ng prices nila it's napakalayo so for those who are interested in buying this unit just comment down below kung may mga katanungan kayo or you can contact directly our kasabot na si Ma'am Clash from Ford Global City or you can just click the link below and put your contact details so bahala na kaming kumontak sa inyo maraming maraming salamat mga kasabot sa patuloy niyong suporta at sa panunood sana lumago ang channel natin para makapagpatuloy ako na makapagbili sa inyo ng mga car deals for those who haven't subscribed yet please uh, click the subscribe button down below and click the notification bell na rin para updated kayo sa mga susunod kong uploads maraming salamat sa inyong panunod mga kasabwat at kung bago ka lang sa channel to please hit the subscribe button at hit ang notification bell para updated ka sa mga susunod kong videos